This video is now brought to you by GeekRetreat.com What is up people, Dobsables is right here and welcome to the final pack opening of the month. Before we start, please check out GeekRetreat.com and today we say goodbye to an amazing set. Sadly, you can't get this set anywhere else. They're so rare in the United Kingdom. Even my secret dealers of Yu-Gi-Oh cards can't even get them anymore. We're saying goodbye to an amazing set which gave us the absolutely amazing card of them all. The Ghost Rare Dark Magician. If you guys have not seen that video, please go back and watch it. We are opening up two boxes of Ghost in the Past 1. But only that as well. We'll also be opening the new one, one box of the second haunting. And if you guys want to know as well, off camera at my local game shop for TCGs, I only bought two boxes of Ghost from the Past 2 and I pulled two Ghost Rares. Put the price right there for what it is worth at this moment in time. The Blue Eyes White Dragon Ghost Rare and the Blue Eyes Ultimate Dragon Ghost Rare. OMFG people, around about £400 worth of cards out of just two boxes. We will open up one of them. We're going to say goodbye with two of the original Ghost of the Past ones. First things first though, we are going to open up Ghost of the Past 2. Yes, and I'm not opening up the first one first because it pains to me to say goodbye to it. It really is. And to be honest, I have lost my knife. <laughs> We have to try and crack this open the old way by ripping the box up. There we go. Rip it a little bit more. There we go. Pop it out. Now, as you guys know, Ghosts from the Past 2 are a little bit cheaper. And also, there's more Ghost Rares. And you get an extra booster pack. Yes. These cost around about $13.99 at Geek Retreat. Ghost from the Past 1, when I first purchased these, which were back in Card Empire, these cost you $14.99 and there was only there was one booster pack less. So yeah. Ghost from the Past 2 is a lot more reasonable priced. Ghost from the Past 1 is quite stingy, but the the um, payoff is so desirable. But anyhow, we got four booster packs of Ghost from the Past 2, and then we're gonna crack open the other two right afterwards. Each card is an, is an ultra rare card, except for the ghost rares, which are the ones we want. Let's see what we can pull out of the first box of Ghost from the Past 2 before we go and move on to the final ones of Ghost from the Past 1. We've got Fossil Machine Skull Wagon, DD Slime, Fortress Dragon, Alien Manite, and the Ganyard Boss of Light. Okay. Now I do know there is a lot, a lot of great cards in this set. But like I said, there's so many people who've opened this up quite some time now. A lot of them big massive hitter cards have dropped in value. But like I said, for me who's editing right now, probably some of these cards are not are worth that much, but now they're not worth that much when they get posted. Division Hero Vion, which is actually a really good card. Magnified Dragon. We've got ourselves Boff of Eternity. And a Chaos Gear Freed. Okay. Third pack, we've got God of Archery, I've not seen that one before, nice, we've got Blaze Dragon, Flute of Summoning Karibo, we got ourselves the Plunder Patrol Lius, and the Reptar Egg, okay, final pack, this is the card we're hunting for, Dark Magician Girl, she is the most expensive card in the set people, so she's the one we're hunting. We got Brute Enforcer, Vampire Sorcerer, we got Dummy and the True Monarchs, Rotillion Swan, Spawn, Chronicles Magician, and that is it. No Ghost Rare in this box, but like I said, we have got a lot of Ghosts in the Past waiting for you later down the line. But now it is time to open up the final two boxes. Well, it's not the final two boxes, I've got one box left. But I'm saving that when we start to open up all of the Ghosts from the Past 2. One after the other, people. That's how I'm going to do it. 
because we can't say full on goodbye to the Ghost of the Past 1. It was an amazing set. We're opening these up. Can we get a Ghost Rare? We only pulled one Ghost Rare out of this whole entire set. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> these are so dusty because I've kept them sealed away for so long. My goodness. We only pulled one Ghost Rare, which was, of course, the most expensive Ghost Rare in the set, the Dark Magician. That's why I want the Dark Magician Girl, just to make it a nice, clean set. But as you guys can see, we have Yugi's best card, we have Kaiba's best card. The only thing we're missing is literally Dark Magician Girl and the Red-Eyes Black Dragon. That'll be it. I'll be so happy to get Dark Magician Girl or the Red-Eyes Black Dragon. But I highly doubt it unless I open up a lot of... Ghost from the past two. Anyhow, Ghost from the past one. We have to take it nice and easy with these packs, people, because these are old. Metaphorse Fusion. Nice. Dragon Knight Draco Escater. We got Fresh Sister. Gear Town. And a Heretic Seal of Creation. Remember, people, these are old now, so. These are so desirable, a lot of people still want to open up some of these Ghost from the Past ones because they're so damn good. Dragon of Vista, a Civilian Shrine, Malicious Charioto, nice Meteor Beacon and Dragon. That's actually a really good card to be honest. But to be honest though people, any Ghost Rare though would be amazing from this because the Ghost Rares in this are super super hard to get. They were way harder than the second haunting. Uh, Staring Night Astia, Sterling, Comerfest, another Seal of Creation. Three packs left to say goodbye to Ghost from the Past. Sunsea Twin, Metal Force Orica, Artifact, Mass Change, and Dragon Knight. And River. Okay. Two packs left. What can we get? We get Recovery, Salvage, Gear Town, Buster Dragon, very good card, and a Dragon Attack. Final pack, people. Now, like I said, people. I did not need any luck for this because the luck for this is so so low. I wanted only my luck for the other set. So, but pretty much though, I have not opened up Ghost in the Past for a long, long time. I don't care what I get. It's just nice to see these cards before we say goodbye to it. Time Thief, Silvered, Crusade, Time Thief, final card. Hey, we get us all the Meteor Black Comet Dragon again. That is awesome. To be honest, people, am I sad to see them gone? I am sad, but like I said, dry away them, them tears, people. It's not all over. It's not all bad news. we still got one box of it left, literally one standard box of it left. But I'm saving them for the big pack opening that we're going to do for Hunt for Ghosts from the Past 2. Either way, people, if you guys enjoyed it, I surely did. Make sure you smash the like button, as always. Comment down below. The people I'm still going to see you guys subscribing. And rest in peace, Ghost in the Past 1. What's an amazing set. I loved it. Cheerio! I like getting these. These are nice. I do have a clue what the volumes are, but I'm sure they'll pop up right now. Ah! Oh!